Hey guys, so welcome back everyone to the brand new Honest Reaction video. This video is Patreon requested. It's for Rainy2408. I hope I'm saying your nickname correctly. Thank you so much for requesting this one again. And uh, today we got a very dangerous song by Taman. Uh, I believe it's called Sexuality. And we're going to be checking out the non-rearranged version. The original one. And then after it, the live performance. And most likely I'm going to post it here on YouTube as well in the same video. It's gonna be in the same video here. So yeah, ready. So it says the first album, press it. Uh, was this the same album that contained Danger? Maybe that was the single or mini album and then this is the full album, something like, not entirely sure. I'm still, you know, I'm kind of new to him. I don't know the whole discography and uh, the names of the albums and which one was the mini one or the full one. Okay, anyways, let's begin here. Before we actually jump in though, guys, make sure to check out my Patreon where you can see more than 500 exclusive reaction videos to BTS, Twice, Red Velvet, Dreamcatcher, IU, Blackpink, Life Stages by these groups, including Taemin, Life Stages, and uh, key drama reactions like my Mr. Hotel De Luna, It's Okay to Not Be Okay, Scarlet Heart, and ETA1 Class. So if you'd like to see all of that exclusive content, make sure to check it out the link to my patrons down below and yeah let's begin okay okay i think i'm ready i'm never fully ready with Timon songs but uh yeah <laughs> i'm ready to the best of my ability wow it's loud okay take it easy i'm just gonna figure out the sound here first so I'm not distracted. Yeah, I think this is good. Mm -hmm. Oh, how that melody goes up. Do 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 do. You see? Just a tad bit, just a tad bit like that. Like that. Like that. Okay. Okay, we're gonna pause it right here, right away, so... Yeah, yeah, this, so this kind of quality in his voice, I really, really like. You guys know me, I really like his voice. In this kind of breathier, more um, sensual type of quality, I really like when he goes for it. The bass line sounds very interesting here. Kind of a disco electronic type of sound to it, right? Kind of. Is it called... Uh, I remember I reacted to his live performance of Move on Heal's sketchbook, and it said something like Cosmo Disco or something, Space Disco. Uh, and I guess this is kind of similar to that. Awesome, awesome layers. Just layering here sounds gorgeous. <laughs> yeah, and again, right here, I really like the background vocals. You see, so the background, I, I really like the spatial separation of the song so the background vocals really sound like they're f kind of like somewhere right here i guess maybe a little to the left i'm not sure but they're behind in his voice the main track is right here so i i really really like that yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hope you're listening to this one in headphones Oh, 
존재 자체 녹여내고 삼켜보다 마침내 서로를 적셔주 So was it his voice here? Sure. Maybe it's someone else. Sounds kind of like a girl here in the background. Like this, Sexuality. this build up and release. Sexuality. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, these electronic synths here. They're on the more old school side, I want to say, but I still like them. I still like the sound of them. So I'm very happy about that. Like, you know, sometimes older sounds and songs kind of throw me off uh, w without really a reason. It's just like a personal preference. So overall, uh, I don't really like older sounds and songs, but in this case, it doesn't bother me in any way. And actually, before we continue, I think I'm going to quickly restart my game here so I don't have to think about it later. And yeah, I'll do it and we'll continue. All right, so let's do it. sound of his voice here. This was cool. <laughs> this was cool. Now I'm actually very curious to hear the rearranged version as well. But now, we will check out the lyrics first, see what it's about, really feel it, and then we'll see the live performance for it, okay? So let's do that. Alrighty, here we go. Okay. It's just that video that was pretty loud.
Yeah, yeah, this part, so with all the... These extra effects, besides the main... Like, this main do 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 part, all the extra things, I really like that. Yeah, this... And then this... <laughs> And here, how it's growing and rising, you see? Keeps going. Sorry, 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 I kind of... I was looking at the lyrics, but I was listening to the music, so I forgot to actually read. Uh, okay. Alright, so should I... Mm. No, no, no. You know what? I'm gonna make my final conclusions after the live performance because it can change my perception of the song once again. Uh, okay, so yeah, let's do that. Let's waste no more time and now see the live performance for it. Okay, I again I hope that the sound is good. I think it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He uh, talks in Japanese here, right? It's a Japanese country. Ooh, that bass is bassy. Okay, instantly, one of my insecurities is gone. <laughs> I've been, recently I've been going to, you know, the dance studio. I'm taking dance classes in a K-pop dance studio, which is super awesome. Uh, and, uh, you know, I think my body works well on cooling itself. Like, I don't get hot, or rather, I don't overheat, you know? Sometimes you, maybe, like, you can do something active and you feel like, oh, you're too hot and you, like, pff, lose energy. That doesn't really happen to me because my body cools well because I sweat a lot. <laughs> so I was like, dude, I, I, I'm the sweatiest one in the class, and I felt just a little insecure about that, and now I see... <laughs> A super sweaty Timon right here. So I'm like, you know what? It's okay. <laughs> he uh he he gets ready to so. so yeah. Yes, yes. Oh man, with his dancing, I really like this combination of really nice and and smooth and flowing moves with then something boom, 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 explosive and very angular. Look at that. Ooh, like a snake. And then, bah, bah. Oh. Ooh, nice lighting change.
<laughs> wow. Ooh, ooh, this is so cool. Yeah, man, hell yeah. Quickly, guys, quickly, one thing, one thing. <laughs> I think, I think this guy looks a little lost. He's like, oh my god, I'm on the same, the same stage with Devin. <laughs> He's singing sexuality, what's happening? <laughs> He's got that kind of expression. <laughs> okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Again, like a snake. Bam. Did he rip the jacket? I think he might have, yes! Look! I think it's ripped! <laughs> Hold on, what did you do? The first time during this performance that he smiled, right? Right, 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 yeah! Bro, he's such a great performer! Ooh, 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 these moves, ooh, these moves. Let's, let's just come back and appreciate the fluidity right here on these moves once again. Man, those pelvic movements are so smooth, right? Great. Awesome. Okay. So which which shot should we finish on? This one. This one. How about this one, huh? How about this one? <laughs> okay. So yeah, maybe maybe the life before has changed the perception of the song just a little bit. Just a tiny bit, but not really. I already liked it to begin with. <laughs> Uh, so, um, before I make my final conclusions, I'm going to restart the camp once again, because I got to the limit very quickly here. So yeah, we're back. Um, about this one, so musically, I definitely liked it. Um, I liked, I think the, the thing that I liked the most is the voice, the way he was singing. I mean, with, with Tamin, it's a pretty usual thing for me to like his voice. Uh, the instrumental, for the most part, I liked it. I can't say 
it's like gonna be one of my favorite songs because still even though the older style or maybe you could call it the retro disco style of the instrumental didn't really bother me in this one so i still enjoyed it which i'm very happy about um it's still not gonna be my favorite sound when it comes to his songs and uh, you know other songs by sm entertainment overall i really like the kind of instrumental that sm uses um, so with this one, I liked it. I certainly enjoyed it. And with the live performance, just the whole other experience because he is so, so, so expressive, right? He, um, one looks so natural on stage, but at the same time, very, very captivating. Like he can make things that look over the top or like, or feel over the top. Uh, meaning you you want to be super super engaged and like look only at him without really trying too hard without looking like he is doing anything special you know it's very natural to him obviously he's been doing it for a very long time he's so skilled uh so yes something like that i might have forgotten a few things so <laughs> as the bottom line once again enjoyed the song uh, very central. I mean, do I have to talk about the lyrics? No, I don't think so. Uh, overall, yeah, what, I think even even though it's not going to be my, one of my favorite songs by him musically, still I will re I will come back to this one pretty often because you know it's very special. It's it's cool. It's sexuality. What it, you know what I mean? So. This is gonna be it for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, Rennie2408, for sponsoring this one. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. As always, take care. Keep listening to great music and watching great live performances just like this one. And love.